I've been brewing a house and I got an awesome pack the other day from Costco. This is the, the taste of Belgian finest. And we got brewed in Belgian four different beers varietal wise and you get eight total in this box. So we're introducing the beers. We got the original Brussels beer. This is Blanche de Bruxelles. It's a blonde beer, 4.5% alcohol, real light. Then we got the Saison du Pont, that is a 6.5 alcohol per volume. It's kind of a lighter. The one I never tried before was the, uh, the name is a Montenetti. That is a 8.5 blonde beer. Never tried it, sounds pretty interesting, pretty cool. And of course, this one I tried as well, Foret. Uh, that one's a uh, 7.5 alcohol per volume, I believe. It is a, some type of a blonde ale as well. It's a Bayesian, it's an organic Saison, but it's a, like a light kind of a blonde color to it as well. So let's begin and try different beers. As always, subscribe. This is Ivan Brewer in the house. And the first beer from the finest of the Belgian brewers. This one right here is the original uh, blonde ale from the Brussels area, uh, Blanche de Bruxelles. Let's dig in. It's one of a one of the beers that I actually like the best. It's definitely my, one of my top 10 favorites. It's only at 4.5 alcohol per volume. It is super light. It has the orange peel finish. Uh, it is a uh, refreshing as 40% wheat is used uh, during the brewing. The rest 60% of the regular grain, but I believe two row. It's very uh, light. As you can see, it pours beautifully shows off in the Ivan Brew glass. We got a two and a half finger head, solid. It's a hazy, golden, beautiful color. It is a, just a tiny bit hazy. It's, you can still sift through it a little bit, so it's not super hazy, but just enough. Um, Aroma-wise, oh yeah. As expected, it does have that, uh, I'd say, young apricot aroma with a little bit of citrusy finish, like a orange peel or lemon peel. Cheers. Mm. Beautiful. Takes me back to the beautiful summers I've been in Europe. This beer is an amazing beer for any season. The flavor is really refreshing, citrusy, and you get that nice burst of flavor that is kind of a, I'd say, begins with citrus and finishes more of a uh, grain finish. So that's uh, where wheat comes through real well here as well. Five out of five hops in my book every time over and over. And as always, subscribe. This is Ivan Brew, right in the comments till next time.